Hey everybody, I'm back. So today I'm going to show you how I got this more dramatic makeup look. I decided to do a smoky eye and a darker lip and my contour is way more intense and my highlight is just everywhere. You can see I'm catching all types of light. So if you're interested in seeing how I got this smoky eye dark lip more of a dramatic look then please keep watching. So before I begin I like to always start off with a moisturized face. Next, I'm going to take my Anastasia Brow Wiz in the color granite and just fill in my eyebrows. To prime my eyes, I'm going to go on with the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer and blend that in with my fingers. Now I'm going to go on with this light brown shade and I'm just going to put this all in the crease area. Next I'm going to go on with this dark blue shade and I'm going to pack that all over the lid. With an angle brush, I'm just going to wing out that blue shadow and then I'm going to bring it in like a cat eye and fill in the space. Now I'm going to go in with this dark plum color and lay that on top of the blue to make the color more intense. So now we're going to go back with that light brown color that we use in the crease and we're just going to blend it out. We don't want the colors to look too separated or that line to look too harsh so we're just going to blend it out so everything looks smooth. Here I'm just taking a makeup remover wipe and just cleaning up the edges of my eyes. To line my eyes, I'm going to use this Kat Von D liquid liner and I'm also going to add a wing. Now I'm going to take my Avon Black Eyeliner Pencil and tight line my eyes. What this is going to do is fill in any blank spaces and make the lash line look fuller. Now it's time to curl those lashes. Now I'm going to use this Kat Von D mascara and coat my lashes. Moving on to the face, I'm going to use my e.l.f. Mineral Facial Primer. For foundation, I'm going to use a L'Oreal True Match Lumi and I'm going to apply that with a foundation brush and then I'm going to follow that up with a beauty blender. Now 
for concealer, I'm going to use my MAC Pro Longwear, and I'm going to put that in the usual spots under my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, forehead, cupid's bow, and on my chin. For added highlight, I'm going to use this MAC Prep and Prime Highlighter Pen in the color Bright Forecast and apply it everywhere I apply the concealer. Now I'm going to take my black eyeliner pencil and I'm going to line my waterline. I'm going to take the pencil down a little bit more because I'm going to smoke out my lash line. Going back in with that dark plum color, I'm going to just blend this into the lower lash line. Now it's time to add mascara to the lower lashes. To contour, I'm just going to use the bronzer side of the St. Lucia e.l.f. palette. And I'm going to hollow out my cheekbones, put it along my hairline, and under my chin. Now I'm going to contour my nose with a smaller brush. You want to start off where your eyebrows begin and work your way down so it looks more natural and then I'm just going to blend this out with my finger. Now I'm going to use my MAC highlighter and I'm going to put that on the highest points of my face and on my brow bone this time. For lips, I'm going to use this ColourPop Ultra Matte Liquid Lipstick in the color Avenue. And to finish and set my makeup, I'm going to use this e.l.f. Mist and Set and spray it all over my face. And we're done. So I hope everyone enjoyed watching this video. I will not say at the end of the video what video I'm going to do next because... I don't know what video I'm going to do next. So you can't hold me to it if I don't say what video is going to be next. Just know that another one's coming. So until the next video.